What's up, my and welcome back to another episode of whatever I said this thing was called in the last episode. My name is Rick Rose, and in today's demonstration, I will be teaching you how to draw a nude. Now, don't worry, I won't be modelling for it myself, uh, so you can stop throwing up blood and crying. No, instead, I will be drawing the female form. Yes, it's soft, it's complicated, and if you stare at it for too long, you pass out. It's the female form! Now, unfortunately, I am a little pressed for time, as I am going to a key party in about an hour. So instead of drawing an entire nude figure, I will just be focusing on the part of any nude portrait that anybody really looks at. Which part of any nude female portrait are people most likely to focus their attention on? Is it A, the elbows? B, the teeth, or C, the breasts. If you answered A, the elbows, you're an idiot. If you answered B, the teeth, you're a freak and you have my respect. And if you answered C, the lovely, lovely breasts, then congratulations, you are an art lover. Yes, friends, it's nature's potatoes, the tit, the breasts. Now, unfortunately, I don't actually have a nude model here with me. Uh, but not even 20 minutes ago, I was watching a film full of breasts, so I reckon I could draw at least one pair from memory. <clears throat> considerably less time than I thought it would. I'll tell you what, just to really make the painting come alive and use up some of this empty space, I'm just going to draw a hand coming in here and giving uh, this little guy a bit of a tweak. Now, uh, it doesn't matter whose hand this is, you know, it's just, uh, <clears throat> just any, just any hand, just any man's hand with quite de quite delicate fingers so we're going to apply the ink now uh, or as I call it the dripping black sex goo oh yeah you like that don't you you dirty canvas I think that's what they're meant to look like okay now it's time to paint our disgusting masterpiece so you just want to get a bit of water on your brush, first of all. Uh, try not to use too much. You know, there's no sense in wasting water. It's one of our planet's natural resources, after all. Um, I mean, if I can avoid it, I try never to use water for anything. I actually have a rule in my house regarding the bathroom. If it's yellow, let it mellow. If it's brown, let it mellow. I live in a very mellow household. Uh, if it's brown with a bit of red in it, let it mellow. Then see the GP. Hit it! Updated all my stats. My breath smelling like Simulac. Can't tell by the friendly chat. You're up for the Milky Way. These notes will ignite you. And my chest hair will entice you. Before the night is done, we'll have lots of fun. Lots of fun. That bouncy way you strut. You slip me out the cut. I know you want my stuff Cause my funk is real enough Sex Panther on the chase That sense you wanna taste Pheromones all over the place Got you hot, look at your face Know what you're wearing tonight So now we're going to paint the nipple and the area of pigmented skin around the nipple uh, which as I'm sure you all know is called the aloe vera <laughs> sleeve there. Um, now again, you can do any colour you want for the sleeve. I'm, I don't know, I'm going to go for a sort of um, <clears throat> eggshell blue. Do what you want though. As you can see, we're painting the background yellow, the most erotic colour there is, after black, so my ex-wife tells me. So there you have it folks, 
a lovely nude, nude, nude. Uh, now just remember, if you are a patron of the arts and you see a nude portrait in a gallery, you have to say something clever. You know, you can't just go, Fuck, that's fucking good! You know, you have to say something more like, Oh, hmm, oh yes, yes, hmm, I, I see the flaps are very well rendered. Or, you know, if it's a man, you go, Oh yes, the very subtle brushwork on the horrible big blue vein. Something like that. So, looking at this, Bear that in mind. Rick Rose. I'm also going to date this picture. Um, I'm not going to put 2018 though. Uh, instead, I'm going to put 1903, because uh, that way it'll be worth more money. Uh, now, I will actually be selling this picture uh, to pay for my alimony. So, uh, to whoever buys it, I hope it goes to a good home. Um, but just do be careful not to hang it near any UV lights. So I hope you've enjoyed this video. Lord knows I've had a terrible time making it. I suppose all that's left for me to do now is free the nipple.